And away we go. Welcome. Good morning, Madison County. This Thursday, September the 28th. I guess I should hit the count now. To our great sponsors, Madison County Emergency Management, the Madison County Library in Richmond and Berea, KYMedia.net, and the Cane Pole in Southern Hills Plaza. Whoa, everybody, today is Thursday, September the 28th, as my grandpa would say, all day long. Welcome. How's everybody doing? Talk amongst yourselves. No, really. Hey, uh, welcome to this edition of Good Morning Madison County. We've got big changes coming up starting next Monday. You'll hear more about that tomorrow on the morning show with Miss Spencer. Uh, first of all, I want to tell everyone how to check out that weather camp forecast, madisonkylive.com. Check it out 24-7, 365 uh, anytime you want to take a look at our live cams more going up soon so take a look at that madisonkylive.com check out our live cams because that's uh that's pretty cool uh let's see going on into uh the uh, speaking of the weather duh, speaking of the weather i've got some information for you on today so you got a 40 to 60 chance of uh Partly and mostly cloudy, thunder, showers, showers possible. And, of course, you've got 20% chance on Friday. The lows, 54 to 61 tonight. The high today, 74 to 81. And the lows, 56 to 61 tomorrow. And, of course, the highs are 75 to 81. Come on, hang on, summer. Please, hang on, summer. Summer, summer. Summer, hang on. Summer, 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 hang on. And that's your weather forecast. You're welcome. The singing is no charge. Ooh, ooh, ooh. What's up next? Pet of the day. You're going to love this little guy. You're absolutely going to love this little guy from the Madison County Animal Shelter. He is so adorable. L and listen to this name. Smooshy. Look at Smooshy. He is absolutely adorable. I'm going to tell you about uh, Smooshy. He is a two-year-old who is sweet, but he's a little shy, has a big personality, loves to cuddle and play after he warms up. Smooshy was primarily an outdoor dog, uh, an outdoor dog prior to coming to the shelter, so she'll need to uh, work on the house training, but would thrive with one's attention, and he appears to be okay with other dogs as well. A Beagle Mix Red. Ooh, color red. There's a song about red. Old Red. And uh, Blake Shelton uh, Bar Slash Restaurant in Nashville, too. Old Red. Two years old. Check out Smooshy. Is he not adorable or not? Smooshy, pet of the day. Check him out. Madison County Animal Shelter on Facebook. Send him a message. Give him a phone call and say, Hey, I saw Smooshy on... Uh, Madison County Live and Good Morning Madison County. But remember, folks, adopt. Never shop. Please don't do that. No. Don't do that. Check out, check out, check out Smooshy. 
Oh, gosh. Hey, um, also, we've got National Day today. Wanted to tell you all what National Day was today. Hold on. Wait a minute. Can I do this? Let's see if I can do this. If I can take that off. Oh, well, I'm sorry. This pet of the day. We just talked about Smooshy. I'm, I'm just experimenting now. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I'll take that off. A National Day today, everybody, is National Good Neighbor Day. Now, who we talk about that all the time on the show. Who would not want to take advantage of National Good Neighbor Day? I'm going to give you some ideas. Being a good neighbor isn't all that difficult. Okay, it starts with kindness, as, as we always mention. It's always the first step. Offer a kind word to your neighbor. A small compliment goes a long way. Bring extra bounty from your garden or baked goods to your neighbor. I really should do that. Uh, I do want to thank Mitch Brown for bringing over some, uh, well, I actually had to go over and get them, and that's okay. He actually made me some barbecue ribs, which are delish. Thank you, Mitch Brown. Bring extra bounty from your garden or bring them baked goods. I'm into the mode of baking cake now. Invite them to join an informal celebration in your home. That's kind of cool. Introduce them to your pets or offer a gardening tip. Maybe I could do that. Uh, ask who they recommend for services such as taxes, painting, car care, and you'll earn their respect by just asking their a question and an advice. So happy Good Neighbor Day. Oh, here's a little history. Becky Matson of Lakeside, Montana created National Good Neighbor Day. And in 1978, United States Jimmy Carter issued a proclamation for Good Neighbor Day. Oh, that's kind of cool. So happy National Good Neighbor Day, everybody. Let's see if I'll change this out. Check out your neighbors, please, and uh, check on them because they might need something. Uh, other information going on today, folks. This is very special. Somebody sent this to us. Um, Bluegrass Assembly number 46, the cookbook. Matter of fact, Georgia Park sent it to us. I just remember that. Now taking orders. They're $20. Mm, I bet you they are delish. Look at those chefs there. Contact 859-358-3961. Georgia Parks or any loyal lady, loyal lady to order. Check out Georgia Parks on Facebook. She's on Facebook. And order that cookbook. They're only $20, folks. Now taking orders for the Assembly number 46 cookbook. As promised, Georgia, I did put that information up there. So, folks, check it out. Uh, go ahead and see uh, Georgia uh, online and on Facebook and check out more of those uh, cookbook offerings. And also, I want to give you something. Fall cake decorating class, folks. It is going on this Sunday, October the 1st, 2 p.m. It's $55 a person. You get a glass of wine, you get cake, materials, and instruction included. Tickets are available on eventbrite.com. That's at Chenault Vineyards. Check it out. Go ahead. All those links and all that important information is on eventbrite.com. And, of course, on Chenault Vineyards' Facebook page. Please like and share uh, Chenault uh and follow Chenault Vineyard's Facebook page so you get more information. we got a lot of stuff coming up at Chenault Vineyard, so check that out. Fall cake decorating class, October 1st. That's this Sunday, 2 o'clock. That's a pretty good price, too, I think. I think that's really good. And information also available. Breaking news. Breaking news. You heard it here first. Maybe, maybe not. Trick or treat is scheduled Richmond and Berea, October 31st from 6 until 8. Both locations, Richmond and Berea. Check out the Berea Parks and Recreation Facebook page, the City of Berea, the City of Richmond Information, Community Information page, as well as Parks and Recreation, Tuesday, October 1st. Yes, it's that time. We need to talk about trick or treat. And that's scheduled for Tuesday, October the 31st. Oh, we need to also check out David Brewer's uh, big exhibit as well on Park Lakes Drive, too. So... Check that out. Tuesday, October the 31st, 6 until 8. Trick or treat is scheduled in Richmond and Berea, folks. Okay, let me see. Is there anything else I may have forgot to mention? I don't think so. Like I said, a big event. Uh, not a big event. Big news coming tomorrow for Madison County Live. We're going to switch things up. Today, folks, going into the fall, this fall, going to switch things up starting next Monday. It's a surprise. Don't tell Colleen. She doesn't know anything about it.
Well, she may know something about it. I have to tell my co-host. Wow. Hey, I miss her. I'm glad to have her back tomorrow. Folks, remember what I always say. Please be kind. Treat others how you want to be treated. Check on your neighbor because they just might need something. Have a great Thursday, everybody, and good morning, Madison County. Thanks to our great sponsors, Madison County Emergency Management, the Madison County Library in Richmond and Berea, kymedia.net, and the Cane Pole in Southern Hills Plaza. business or organization wants to be a community partner with Madison County Live and help promote good news and events in Madison County, reach out to us on Facebook or email us at randy at kymedia.net.